Every day, more people arrive in eastern South Sudan to flee Sudan's increasingly violent war. South Sudan itself is barely at peace, but it's safer than staying in their native Sudan. The conflict has triggered the world's largest displacement crisis, along with hunger, according to the World Food Program. We came by bus. It took us two days to get here. We came from Sudan because of the war. We came to look for a place to stay and settle. What we need is food. The immediate support we need is to eat, to be able to survive. Newly arrived displaced people in South Sudan make up 35% of those facing catastrophic levels of hunger, the highest possible level. The rates of malnutrition are high. We are finding that the most impacted are the women and children. And that's why a range of services are available at the border immediately when they cross in, but also when they move to the transit center. Over 25 million people across Sudan, South Sudan and Chad are trapped in a spiral of deteriorating food security. The war in Sudan is sending millions spiraling into what could soon be the world's largest hunger crisis. In South Sudan, I've met mothers and children who have fled violence many times. They've escaped the fighting, but they struggle to escape the hunger. There's still no prospects of a comprehensive ceasefire in Sudan's war, nearly 12 months since hostilities erupted. <laughs>